if you haven't seen my face before, my name is Maisie and I am currently in my second year studying for a BSc in Nutrition. Don't know why I said it like that, probably because I'm about to sit an exam from home. If you've seen my videos before you'll know that because of Covid, basically all our exams from last year and this year have been online so far. I'm a bit nervous and now you might be thinking oh it's so much easier to sit an exam from home well I couldn't tell you if it was or not because I haven't sat an exam in uni yet however I do feel like even though you have access to your notes and the internet and other such things you don't have the time to be looking things up and if you don't understand what the question is asking you're screwed so <laughs> This morning I've got my immunology exam um, which counts to 30% for my nutrition and physiological interaction module and it's an hour long and I think there's 45 questions equating to like 50 marks and yeah I'm quite nervous. It's currently 8.37 so just over 20 minutes so instead of trying to cram information into my brain right now I am going to sit and watch a little bit of YouTube and then at about 5 to I will open the exam link etc, put some music on, make sure I've got my drinks, I've just made myself coffee so I should be fine and we will get going. Today after this exam I am going to the gym to sweat out any bad vibes from the exam uh, so I'm already dressed in my gym clothes repping a really old My Chemical Romance t-shirt. Yeah, that's as far as the plans for today have gone. In your mind, one thing I am going to do is quickly read over the very brief notes that I wrote for whenever I got a question wrong when I was doing flashcards and stuff. And yeah, hopefully that will mean anything that I was sort of unsure of, I can just solidify that I definitely know the right answer now. I'm just gonna have a quick read over some of those and then it's time to get started. I'm acting excited, I'm not excited at all, not one bit. And more variety. Here we go. Oh, it says negative marking, it said there was going to be no negative marking and now it says that there's negative marking. Ah, pray for me. Finished the exam, off to the gym. Exam was absolutely horrible, probably failed. That was fun, do you want to say hi? I'm off from the gym now and I'm going to have a shower. I've just made myself a coffee. I'm going to have a shower and then I'm going to look at my notes and things for my next exam, which is next Tuesday, and sort of put a plan in action of what I'm going to do over the next week in order to not do as badly in that exam as I definitely have just done in this one and about three or just after three I'll leave to get the little one from school and this evening I'm gonna make chili as well which I've probably made in a vlog before because we do make it a lot but we haven't had it in ages so that'll be nice oh and lunch is already made I've prepped it last night it's like a pesto pasta with tomatoes and we're just gonna cook off like a vegan chicken fillet thing to go with it so that'll be nice and I'll show you when I have that Hair and makeup done. I did lots of procrastinating and I've been watching some more YouTube as well. So I haven't actually got um, my plan done yet for my revision for the rest of um, this semester, which is like eight days. So it is 10 to 1, so I'm going to go and put lunch on and then come and do the plan and then go and eat lunch. <laughs> some of my like um, revision posters from first year because I was just getting out um, sort of like the correct definitions for things like gluconeogenesis, glycogenolysis, glycogenesis and all of that stuff. So just getting that written down in a little notebook as a sort of form of revision and now I'm going to do a load of flashcards and that's pretty much what I'm going to do now. It's now nearly two o'clock. I'm going to do that until about three. Go and get Tyler and pop to the supermarket. And then when I get 
back, maybe do a little bit more flashcards and then make dinner. And then eat dinner, do more flashcards, do a little in bedtime. It's very much the same as most of my vlogs, but here we are. Also just put the album Loveless one on by Loveless. Um, I think it came out last year or the year before and I discovered it a couple of weeks ago and I've listened to it about 15 times. It's very good. I highly recommend you check it out. Kitchen is horrific. Almost as horrific as my fringe after I've been out in the damp weather. <laughs> Do you want to say hello? No. No, okay. So I put my rice on and now I've got, if I can't see because I can't do this backwards, but I've got my kidney beans and chickpeas, chopped tomatoes, courgette, onion, garlic. I'm going to cook some broccoli as well to have on the side. Um, oh, and I need tomato puree and my mints, my veggie mints. If you like, I will put the recipe in the description box. For all 20 people that will inevitably, inevitably see this video. But it is really yummy, and I'll show you when I've cooked it. Everything is cooking. I'm going to do a COVID test because um, I'm shooting for work like basically every week um you know just to make sure i'm not accidentally spreading the old coronavirus about without knowing it so this this is actually one of the ones that you only have to do your nose which is nice because you've all done covid tests they're not fun i'm about to do a lovely little covid test and fingers crossed it's negative or this video is about to take a wild turn of events <laughs> Ta -da! it actually doesn't look that big on camera but it's huge isn't it isn't it so much also love the love the look of this table i've got a martini glass with water in it jack's got a beer glass with zero percent alcohol beer in it and then we've just got various like milk unopened milk cartons and condiments on the table <laughs> but yeah delicious Oh my god, it looks like I'm filming on an actual potato. <laughs> it's so dark. Um, I've got fairy lights on and stuff. Mm, it's a bit better. Um, but I am just about to do some more flashcards before it is Tyler's bedtime. And I think I might do a bedtime story with him tonight. Me and Jack sometimes, m most of the time, I'll do bath time and Jack does story time. Um, but I might do story time today. And then... I will carry on with my flashcards for a little bit, take my makeup off, and then get into bed and read my book, which is My Sister the Serial Killer. Um, I'm not going to butcher the author's name, but there it is. I'm really enjoying it so far, and I'm only like 40 pages in, I think. But yeah, really enjoying it so far. I will leave the vlog here because there is nothing else interesting that is going on in my life today. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, feel free to subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this and press the little thumbs up button so that I know that you did indeed think it was worthy of a thumbs up or worthy of your time. And I will see you all very soon.